But the recent reemergence of the Red Room and Army in Dragon Ball Super Superhero, I started thinking back on the antagonists that I wanted to see in the stories, as she had much room for potential. Android 21. Like many of the androids in the series, Android 21 was created by Dr. Shiro as a new type of bio-android, just like her predecessor Cell, although she is vastly superior. Just like in Cell, she contains the genes and cells of various warriors, such as Goku, Vegeta, Frieza, and even Boo, and researchers were added to her in order to further boost her intellect. This made her an exceptionally strong android, as she is easily, easily defeating Cell, the Ginyu Force, and Frieza, while they were all inhibited by the waves. While she wasn't too powerful when we first see her in Fighters, with all the events that have happened on Earth prior to the Red Ribbon's emergence, they have access to many more cells of ridiculously powerful warriors, like Broly, Trunks, Hit, Moro, and many other old cells that they could have from previous opponents the Sea Fighters have faced. But the crazy power the androids can gain from training, as if we receive the power drill on Android 17, and Android 21 was a train, especially with the cells of Frieza and Broly inside of her. She would have the potential to grow ridiculously powerful, possibly having the chance to rival Goku and Vegeta in power.